Greetings Internet, it's Mike here from Rabies Reviews and today we're going to be taking a look at Transformers Combiner Wars Legends Class Bombshell. Uh, for those that don't know, Bombshell is an Insecticon. Uh, he is a Legends Class that puts him in the, the range of like scrap and all and stuff like that from uh, the, was the Generations line, I guess. Um, much better figure, in my personal opinion, than Scrapnel is. Uh, this this man carries his kibble well. Um, but uh, he does have his drawbacks, which come with little secret bonuses, and we'll, we'll get into that here in a second with the articulation. Um, he doesn't come with any accessories. He is his own accessory. His guns are built into his fists. He has gun fists, so he can come out blazing. Uh, so, you know, it's, it's, it's whatever you want. Uh, so let's go ahead and get, get in the articulation. Uh, this is uh, one of the negative points is he does not have head articulation, so he can't really look left or right. Uh, and because of that, they gave him that whole, uh, what was it, the the, uh, the Michael Keaton Batman turn. Huh. What's over there? Where he has to turn his whole body uh, just to look. Uh, and I thought that was pretty funny. Um, but uh, he does have ball-jointed shoulders and ball-jointed elbows, so he can go all over the place with his arms. Very wiggly. Very wiggly indeed. Uh, and he has the waist swivel, like I mentioned, for the Michael Keaton. What? What's that over there? What? Oh no. Uh, and then he has uh, a nice deep, deep knee hinge, as well as a thigh swivel. Uh, so if you get the bug legs out of the way, he does get a good range of motion there. Uh, and also he has knee guns. And they are articulated. So he can shoot somebody in the knee, or he can shoot him in the crotch. So he's got crotch, aiming, knee-mounted guns. And it's a little strange, I guess. But he is a bug, so there you go. Uh, let's go ahead and get him transformed into bug mode. First off, we will go ahead and uh, cover up that beautifully painted face. And then flip that up as well. And this obviously is going to form the front end of the bug. And we'll go ahead and rotate his waist. 180 degrees, and then get the bug legs out of the way by flipping those out. Clip the two legs together, just right there, there's a tab and a slot, just like that. And then go ahead and rotate the legs all the way up and down. And if you got to move the arms, you got to move the arms. So there you go, there's the bottom half of the bug. Go ahead and flip them over, take the arms, rotate them back on that little hinge there and then there's a half tab half slot concoction here and they marry together quite nicely and then you can rotate the rest of the bug legs out there you go and this is a little wiggly uh, but on the plus side he does have four butt guns just just in case anyone thinks about sneaking up on him you can just zap them all four times there you go. But yes, uh, I, I do think uh, for, for an Insecticon, he is uh, the right size, uh, the right heft. He's very light, uh, and he's got uh, pretty great detail. Uh, the panel lines are fantastic. The paint apps are great. There's gold, but it's got like this little silver flake in it, and the red also has a little flake in it. Uh, there's a little silver picked out for the buttons. Uh, there's no translucent plastic on him or Scrapnel. Uh, I don't remember if there was any on the kickback that we got in, in the Generations line, uh, but that, that was a deluxe class kickback, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but yeah, so there you go. There is uh, Transformers Combiner Wars Legends Class Bombshell. He's a bug. Just to make it very clear to you guys, this is a bug. Bug!